I don't want my work to feel like a needle jumping on a broken vinyl, even though that vinyl must contain the most gorgeous music you have ever heard. I rather throw away what I have achieved and try something else. I kind of had the uh, typical life of a kid growing up in East Germany, you know, life was quiet. When I became into my second half of my teenage years, I started having problems in East Germany because of certain political convictions that I was arrested and then I left East Germany in 1985 to West Berlin when I was 19 years old. During the last 25 years I have been mainly working with photography. I have been working about the transformation of Berlin after the war came down. I photographed Berlin-based Allied soldiers of the former, former Allied countries. I have been photographing prison gates, I have been photographing curtains from abandoned industrial and governmental buildings in East Berlin. I have been photographing glaciers on the Argentinian side of Patagonia. I have always been interested in places and, uh, let's say, social, socio-cultural constellations that undergo a huge transformation process. And I always had the feeling that Cuba has a very unique history present and hopefully a very unique future as well. I tried to find a way to translate this unknown dynamic into images. When a girl in Cuba turns 15 years old, or Los Quince, it's probably the most important day in her life, the transformation from being a teenager to the beginning of your adult life. And then I thought maybe portraying a generation of young Cuban women all born in the year 2000 is probably an interesting metaphor to speak about the island and the society as a whole which is kind of going through a similar transformation process. Started building an all-Cuban team. I decided to use these colonial traditional dresses. I also decided that I would like to photograph the girls in their daily surroundings. I tried to create a portrait of a generation of young Cuban women that stand there with like confidence and, uh, and proud to speak about the future. I never believed in photographing a, a complex world in a very similar manner, no matter where you are and what you are photographing. It's not only the world around us changing, it's also my own interests are changing, my knowledge is changing, my abilities and skills are changing over all these years.